The Amla 1965 Chase. Two mile three furlongs, grade two. Traditionalists up the top for Paul Rhodes. And we've got Fox Norton, Henry Hill, Power Play. St. David's Day is the favourite, joint favourite for Pontypool Racing, along with the Dark Lord for Joshua Sutherland. Seven to two. Uh, Gilda, Never Murray, Pascal Dictator Half and Racing. And might have been Never Murray the last one I missed there. But anyway, they're over the first of 16. <clears throat> no, on the... Oh, one's dropped the jockey there. One of the joint favourites, St. David's Day. So bad luck, Gray. So go over the ditch, which is the third. So Fox Norton leads from the riderlist. St. David's Day, then traditionalist. The Dark Lord up there, now the favourite. And the walks through it, the Dark Lord as well. And that's dropped a couple of lengths easily. So around this bend and the ones near the tail, the wider ones got shuffled back a bit. <clears throat> and it's Fox Norton. Takes them over the fifth. A sticky one at the tail there by Gilda. But it's Fox Norton. They run up the home stretch here. Over the sixth. That probably will be the last jump of the race. Pass the tote board, and here should be the winning post. And a lap to go. 12 furlongs to be exact. And Fox Norton, clear leader by three or so lengths to the traditionalist. Two and a half away to power play and tainted half and the whitest. Whitest runner is the Dark Lord. In behind them is Never Murray. Uh, Pass Classic, Henry Hill, Gilda. Fast jump there by Gilda. Gained a length or two. But it's Fox Norton. Slow jump there by Henry Hill. Nine furlongs left. And over the ditch they go. They're all safely over it. And Fox Norton leads them down to the mile pole. And over the tenth. And it's going well, this Fox Norton, from the traditionalist. The whitest is there. Out wider, getting closer past Classic. Tainted half. Uh, never Murray, the Dark Lord. Then a small gap to the stable mates, power play, and Gilda, and out the tail, Henry Hill. Around this bend. And over the 11th, a slow jump from the favourite, but it's Fox Norton. Quick jump there by Tain at half. It's Fox Norton, a length Tain at half. They go over the ditch, a fast jump by the leader. So too from Traditionalist and the Dark Lord joins in out wider. Pass Classic and uh, Tainted Half pick up the bit again as they run on towards the home turn and there's two groups here. And uh, you'd think the winner would come from the first group but it's Fox Norton rounding this home turn. And it'll straighten up about two and a half, three clear of Pass Classic. The Dark Lord, Tainted Half, the Traditionalist <clears throat> Nothing else can win. As they go over the 15th and they run towards the last. And um, and it is Fox Norton in front from the Dark Lord raising another effort. It's Fox Norton at the one and a half. They come to the last. It was a fast one by the Dark Lord and has jumped into the lead at the furlong. And the Dark Lord's in front. Fox Norton still battling back on the insides, coming back. Fox Norton hits the lead again from the Dark Lord, and it's Fox Norton, and Fox Norton wins from the Dark Lord. Traditionalist flew home for third, pass Classic fourth.
Strong run by the winner, Fox Norton. Not sure if this card will pop up in time, but Fox Norton is our winner. Congratulations, John. Second, the Dark Lord, Joshua Sutherland. Third, traditionalist Paul Rhodes. Fourth, Pass Classique, Martin Leadham. Fifth, Gilda for Kevin Minahan.